some large clay soft spots on stage one. We've also found rock throughout various places and we've also had the challenges of COVID as well as keeping the club being able to maintain tennis throughout the construction. Having 11 courts meant that we could do the project over um, two phases which was really um, important because we've been able to have those facilities while the other half has been done so that's worked really well. It's 11 courts, uh, five are using classic clay profile synthetic grass. The council asked us what surface we would prefer and they accepted our choice. This is a very new surface that has the same ITF profile as Antica. People love it, it's really very similar to, to play. Similar bounds and similar pleasure to play tennis. The big key point post COVID is that um, contactless engagement with the club. You can do it all online. There's a pin pad access on all of the gates, which acts as a security buffer as well as contactless entry. When you book, you get a code, which you then um, enter into the gate. The gate opens and then you gain access. It's a great system. Couldn't believe the night that we turned on the lights. It was almost like daytime. There was no shadowing whatsoever and the um, lux levels absolutely exceeded what we had designed. So it was really, really good result. So we've also added a 70,000 litre grain harvested tank. That's going to obviously help with sustainability and keep the water bills down low. Um, we've also put a new maintenance shed in for ease of maintenance. We've also put a brand new pump shed in to house all the equipment that's going to be servicing the clay courts. The feedback from members on the, the courts has been fantastic. The playability is sensational. They love the lights, they can see the ball now. It's fantastic. It just has made the facility safer, more accessible, more family friendly, as well as a better facility for those competitive top level players, so yeah, we're really excited. Everybody is so happy. The future will certainly be fantastic for our club. The Western Suburbs should be really proud of these facilities. If you come out and see for yourself and join as a member, you'll understand what I'm talking about.